we had a little problem with our kid when he was born. Butt was real sensitive and uh, couldn't use normal stuff on him. We had a heck of a time trying to find good baby wipes. Uh, tried all the sensitive, no perfume, this, that, and the other. And it was just wiping his skin right off his butt. So I searched and searched, and the doctor told us to use uh, cotton balls and uh, some baby soap, any type of little baby soap or whatever. And eventually he got too big to wear a few cotton balls and was just nothing but a mess. So eventually, through searching here and there and seeing all the reviews and people didn't like this one because it was too soft and that one because it was too rough and some of the uh, dry wipes would bunch up in your hands instead of wiping the kids butt so we had to come up with something this is what we come up with we actually called the hospital and asked what dry wipes they used uh, and we actually wound up getting the wrong ones but there's two different types. There's uh, the Kendall Curity and there's another Kendall, but they're just washcloths. If you look right there, uh, I don't know if you can see that or not, but uh, they're non-sterile washcloths. They work just fine. Uh, and are a lot better, more wipey-like than trying to use uh, cotton balls. But this is what we do. We take the package, and this is, you buy a case of them. comes with like 12 of these packages. It's like uh, 60 bucks delivered to your door. It takes about a week, depending on where you get them. And you just take the package, you open it up, and you take anything. I usually use the side of a box, but I have this right now. And you just take them out. Now, each one is huge. About twice the size of a white bee. So if you leave them, they come tri-folded and then folded in half. And you just... Hang them over the side of something like this, I can take them out one at a time. Like that. Get a nice pile of them going. Use a decent kitchen shear, something that's clean enough, and you cut them right across the center like this. You now each one is two. I usually take them, and they come like this, and I turn them 90 degrees, or 180 degrees, so that they fit flat. They don't lump up one side or the other. And you put them in there. Once you get about half of them done, about half of the pack. Now this is just a Chinese food container that uh, some of our Chinese food came in, and we find them handy uh, for a little while until they break. And they're definitely handy for this. But once you get about half of them, you take a, a little bottle. This is an eight-ounce bottle. Uh, a cleansing bottle that you get at the hospital. I I like it because it's got the unique little four spout thing, but you could use anything. So you take about eight ounces of water to half of that. And you take your soap of choice. We like the nighttime. Of course, baby sleeping is nice. You just put a little bit of soap in there. Just a little bit. Maybe a quarter of a teaspoon, half a teaspoon, like. Mix it up real well. And then you just shoot it in there. Now, the reason why I like to do half is because this stuff is really absorbent. Okay. And what you're going to have to do, as you see, that's all wet. And this side's still dry, kind of. When you, once you get the whole thing, or half the thing in there, it's going to be even more so, right? And I'll I'll waste whole eight ounces on half of that, and then flip it over because the bottom's going to be uh, dry. Or you squeeze it and then flip it over. 
and then do the other half. Put the other half on top, another 8 ounce bottle. 6 to 8 ounces is good. You'll find your range once uh, once you get used to it, how you like it. Uh, <laughs> and then what I'll do is I'll take, and the whole thing will be in here. You know, imagine all that. By this time, it's been all unfolded and chopped up, so it's sitting like this tall. Once you get it wet it down, it goes down a little bit, and you, you take the last eight ounces and you just spray it out over there, and then uh, you take this on the top and you just squish it down, pull it back up, find where it's dry, and you'll feel it on the side. Flip it over there, do that one more time. Good amount of pressure, bring it back up, and then you can take it to the sink. Drain out a little bit of excess, and you got a hundred wipes. Perfect for the sensitive baby. Like I said before, these are Kendall Curity washcloths. Kendall makes another washcloth, uh, disposable washcloth. Um, I can't think of what they call them. This is the Curity line. Comes out like this. And believe me, it may look see-through, but those things are just about as good as most wipies, and they're pretty tough too. Yeah, you rip it a little bit, but it's pretty tough for what it is. A wipey would have ripped like that too. And it works great for sensitive butts. And there, there you go. You got your thing to hang them on, you got your scissors, you got your container, and an old wipey container Container works fine too. I just happen to like this because it's convenient. I can squeeze it out with it and not get all soaked and everything. Uh, and then you about 16, 15, 16 ounces of water per, key, per pack. Dad, are you doing a video? And a little bit of soap. That's it. Dad, are you doing a video? And now I'm uh, yes, princess. I'll get you something in a second.